Grand Old Partisan celebrates more than 17 decades of Republican heroes and heroics. Today, I express appreciation for Republican commitment to safeguarding civil rights. Twice while President-elect, and again a month after taking office, Warren Harding met with James Weldon Johnson, an NAACP activist and lyricist of Lift Every Voice and Sing. They discussed the urgency of ending Democrat devilry against African Americans. This day of 1921, President Harding delivered his first address to Congress. Notably, he said, quote, Congress ought to wipe the stain of barbaric lynching from the banners of a free and orderly representative democracy. I am convinced that in mutual tolerance, understanding, charity, recognition of the interdependence of the races, and maintenance of the rights of citizenship lies the road to righteous adjustment. Back to basics for the Republican Party is my civil rights history of the GOP. To quote the book, The more we Republicans know about the history of our party, the more the Democrats will worry about the future of theirs. For more information, see grandolpartisan.com.